for three days, the fashion world focuses on Ier and the makers and shakers of tomorrow. At runway shows, art exhibitions and concerts, fashion's luminaries come together in the southern French town. Their mission? Discovering future stars. Germany's Henning Jorke is one of ten finalists in this year's competition. It's really great for me and for my work to be shown in such an international and professional context and to get feedback from people who are in that part of the industry. Jorke was selected from 350 applicants. The 28-year-old studied fashion design at the Berlin University of the Arts. His graduation collection was the basis for the seven looks he'll be showing at the festival. The idea is a party in the 1920s. I've also worked with elements like a roll of wrapping paper, which makes you think of balloons. I got a lot of inspiration from Jeff Koons' Balloon Dog. The connection between art and fashion is one of the hallmarks of the Ier Festival. It takes place at the Villa Noai, overlooking the town. Since it was built in the 1920s, the Bauhaus-style building has been a place for artists to meet and share ideas. This year's jury president, Felipe Oliveira Batista, is the creative director of Lacoste. His career began when he won the competition 10 years ago. We are looking as well, and most of it is someone, people that had like very clear vision as well of what they're about. So we're, we're looking above all as well of, you know, very individual statements and uh, because it's, you know, you have to, yeah, you have to stand out in a way. <laughs> For Henning Jorke and his fellow finalists, this is a massive opportunity to hit the big time. But three shows in three days is a huge challenge, primarily on the logistics front. Now the stress is building up with all the packing and transportation. There's no time to take a break. There's no better stage for the finalists to showcase their talents to the industry's top names. You have to be creative. And still we are an industry, so we need to integrate talents and select them carefully. There's also an award for Best Emerging Photographer. As ever, the aim of IER is to bring together artists from all manner of disciplines. The appearance of Radiohead bassist Colin Greenwood is no coincidence. That's one of my favorite things about being a musician, is the fact that I've made music, that I've helped to make music that other people listen to and becomes part of the fabric of their lives is amazing. A few kilometers away, the all-deciding fashion show is being held in this renovated barn. The ten young designers are making their final preparations. Meanwhile, the first guests are arriving, and Henning Jurka is getting excited. It's what spurs you on, experiencing the moment of the fashion show. And there's also a lot of adrenaline involved. The most important guests are the jury, headed by Portuguese fashion designer Felipe Oliveira Baptista. Then comes the moment of truth for Henning Jurka and his collection, called Celebration. The ten contestants compete for several prizes. The main one, the Grand Prix de Jury, comes with a 15,000 euro purse. And this year's big winner is... Satu Maranen from Finland. I feel really, really happy. <laughs> But may maybe I haven't had any time to think what just happened, but I'm smiling, so that tells a lot, yeah. It's been great just to be here, and I think lots of things are going to happen now. For all the young designers present, just making it to the finals of the IER Fashion Festival is a big step on the road to stardom. <laughs>